I'm at the March Mayhem press conference at the York Hall with coach Paul Cook and Mark Little. How are you boys? Yeah, good, thank you. Yeah, good. How's preparation been going for your second fight? Yeah, really, really well. Yeah. Uh, let him tell you. He's the boss. <laughs> yeah, I just yeah, to try and spread it away. You working on anything specific in the gym? Yeah, yeah. Um, body movement, everything really. I don't like to say too much over here, but otherwise, I um, don't know how to play. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you had no amateur experience. How was that for you then, getting in the ring in your last fight? Uh, I didn't have an amateur career, but I had a, a license. So I sort of had an idea what it was like to get in the ring. But it was completely different here, doing it. So. Yeah, no, it was good though. Really enjoyed it. Amateur it was great, man. Do you find a big change between the like, unlicensed amateur to going into the professional yeah. ring? Yeah, yeah. What's the main difference for you? It's just more intense to be a professional. It's even on your, on your mind. He's uh, coming from like, someone who he comes to me when it would be like a, a click fit. It was 21, 22, 21, 22, 22, 22, 22, 22. It wouldn't get the weight off. Now I've been got a couple of slang off, I said to him, oh, I'll find I'll put you in the, in the ring, you went on them around there. I won't get in that ring. And it's all gone from there, really. So you come in the gym wanting to lose, just lose weight and then yeah, you yeah. started boxing? About four, four years ago, joined the gym with Paul. Uh, seen him a couple of times, training some other people. Grew some nuts up and up to him and said, can you train me? Just to lose weight, really. Like I said, I did 22 stone. And then from there on, it just... How much weight did you lose? In I've lost about eight stone now. Wow, that's so no. awesome. yeah. I need your own. 14 stone there. Yeah, 14 stone. I was at the last fight, I was 13 stone, 13 for the last fight I weighed in. So. Everything on track for this fight? Yeah, it's been perfect. Weights, no problem. No. Everything's been going well, yeah. Do you think that learning on the job is important? Do you think that you're just continuously learning? Is that an important yeah, thing I mean, for you? And even more from the last fight, I mean, I've said to you all the time in the gym. I learn every single day now, where before, in the unlicensed, you do learn, but I think you take it in a different mindset. Yeah, you, you don't take this as serious, but I mean, I know now that this is this is it, I've made it now, so I feel like I learn everything every day, every day in the gym, yeah. you do something, I say, so I've learned something else today, and you do, you sit and work on it. You go up and you think about it and things like that, so it's, yeah, it's completely different now. <laughs> it's different. When you went in, when you went on, we, we got over to the uh, white collar. Yeah. White collar flights with the uh, egg garden and the top one. So that was a that was another step. So we got well, we have to cut the fires out, then we went down license, no top, no egg garden. So that was another step. So if it was a bonus, and like to get to here was like a massive achievement. So in the next 12 months you just aim to keep learning, keep growing. Yeah, just yeah. every every flight's it's just another step in the journey. Just get yeah. stronger, stronger, and then just see what what brings that still turns up. So Do you think it's important not to put too much pressure on it? Because it clearly sounds like you're just taking it no. literally each step. That's how it's got to be. There is. That's how it's got to be. Oh, that's that's the, no, at the moment, at the moment, especially with him. Because like we can he ain't, he ain't gonna have to lose. Because just getting into his first fight was an achievement by itself. Winning his first fight was another achievement. Of course. Yeah. So now every fight he has is just another achievement. So he's gonna have to lose. Do you ever look at your opponents? Or do you just let him let him train you and come in and face it? I do no, not I don't study nothing. I mean that's for me that's Paul's job. If Paul tells me what to do then I'll just go out and do what Paul asks, you know what I mean? That's at the moment ain't a yeah, I mean, ain't a massive thing to you know what I mean? We look at their record, see what they've done and if I think it's good enough for him, then we go for it. Just to learn, learn, learn but yeah, I don't know if I fight. I don't really look into it, it don't really bother me, I mean. It's scary, I'm honest. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Good luck for the 12th, yeah, I'm reporting as always, and hope it goes well. Thank you very much, cheers.